Jessica, there is concern that more of the building may come down, which is why they have closed off the sidewalk here and also part of Moody Street, creating a bit of a traffic hiccup. As we know, the rest of Moody Street already closed to traffic to outdoor dining. Now, around 9 a.m. this morning, Waltham Fire got a report about a broken front door, a store front door on Moody Street. And it turned out the damage was actually a result of a partial roof collapse. You can see uh, from these photos a gaping hole that was created in the rooftop, which Waltham's fire chief says led to the front windows being pushed out. The commercial building has been vacant for more than a decade. The owner says he's had plans to develop the property into a hotel, but the project is in the permit process. Well, it's not a good day for me today, waking up and getting a phone call, not waking up. I mean, I was in the office and I get a phone call that uh, the building had partially collapsed. Um, but we'll, we'll, we'll take it down, we'll clean it up, so make sure it's safe. Demolition of the building is expected to take place tomorrow. The fire chief says the cause is the, the impact of all the weather over time. Uh, that's essentially deteriorated part of the building. And again, this top part of Moody Street now, uh, only two lanes going, in a, one in each direction. Coming up at 530, we'll tell you more about those plans that the owner has to develop this prime piece of property. Live in Waltham, Sarah Kanji, WCVB News Center.